What's going on YouTube? Kamikaze Von Doom here with another Division 2 video. Now in this video I'm going to talk everything that there is to know about the new exotic holster, the Wave Form. Now the Wave Form is introduced in Season 4, which is going on right now. And in the reward track, around level, what is it, 90? Yep, level 90, you are able to get this bad boy. So the Wave Form Exotic Holster. So let's look at it. So here is the Wave Form Holster. Um, looks a little industrial, not, not too shabby, if I do say so myself. Now, <clears throat> in the description, it says graphite layers are suffused throughout the holster Kevlar weave that when the wearer moves, it creates an inductive oscillating electromagnetic field. And this field allows for remote charging of electrical devices. Sounds pretty cool, right? All right. So look at the attributes. So it comes with a skill tier, skill damage, and skill haste. So you can already figure out that this holster is aimed towards skill builds. More importantly, this is aimed towards skill damage builds. Now look at the talent. It's called Alternating Current. Now Alternating Current generates a stack of 3% skill damage. This will go on one side of your skills and it'll cap out at 10 and then it'll move to the other skill and cap out at 10. So think of it as like an hourglass effect. I'll show you in the targeting range what I mean. But basically your left skill will start to charge up to 10 stacks. It'll sit there for a few seconds and then it'll start to lower its 10 stacks. And as it's lowering its 10 stacks, your right skill will start to gain those stacks. So it'll go from one to 10, and then as it's going from 10 down to one, it'll go 10, nine, and then the other one will go one, two, all the way up. And then it'll cap out, sit there for 10 seconds, and move to the other way. So back to this talent, it generates a stack of 3% skill damage on one of your skills every second. It'll cap out at 10 seconds, and after it's capped out, it'll sit there for 10, uh, it, after the 10 stacks, it'll sit there for 10 seconds. Now this process just keeps on repeating over and over and over. So I have put together just a normal skill build, glass cannon combined arms with the capacitor. And let's go to the firing range and I'll show you what it's all about. So I hope you guys are enjoying season four. Let me know in the comment section below how you guys are farming your levels. For me personally, it was the invaded dark zone and then the manhunt because you got the uh, 15 levels of double XP from the manhunt. Now you can see under my ammo number, that is the waveform proc indicators. So you can see there's a left hand and a right hand. And you can use the, uh, the indicator as arrows. So the bold white is where the stack is. So right now you can see that that arrow is pointed to the left. So that is my left skill. Or for Xbox, that's my left bumper. And now you can see that the indicator is filling up on the right side. And now it's capped out on the right skill. Or for Xbox, the right bumper. So I accidentally passed over Invulnerable Elite. So I'm not going to do anything crazy on here. I'm just going to show you guys how the skills work and then get you out of here. So nothing crazy. You can see that it is maxed out on the left skill. So let's look at that. So about 108, nothing's going on. And then you can see the indicator is lowering and it's filling up on the right side. So it was once 108, and now it's going down, now it's down to 97. So now it went from 97 to 108, and then 108 back to 97. So then we kill that, 
and we'll wait for the buff to come back to the right side. And as that's going, we can check out these numbers. So the turret just by itself about 156 and you can see the indicators for the left skill, which I'm not using. And then after 10 seconds, it'll start to fill up to the right side. You can see right there. And as it's filling up, you can see the damage from my turret is increasing. So this kind of just bounces back and forth, skill to skill, giving you more skill damage. And now you can see my turret is at 173 just by itself. So it'll start to move back over, and then you can see now it's lowering again, going back down. So that is the waveform. So you put that on a skill build, like a drone turret build, for example, and this will just buff it the entire time you are playing. Use that for the capacitor, and have a good day. Now, you can get this again, level 90 of season 4. So get it while you can. You have plenty of time, a few more months, actually. So yeah, I'll show you guys a couple of builds. If you want to see a waveform build, let me know in the comments section below. Just hit waveform build. And if I see, you know, whatever, 50 or 100 of them, maybe I'll put that at the front of my line. But a lot of you keep asking for Scorpio builds, so I might, I don't know, we'll see. Let me know what you guys think below. And while you're at it, hit that thumbs up, subscribe to the channel, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.